So moving on to example 2, what do I have? X tends to 1 of some function. So I'll simply substitute the value. So I have 1 square plus 1 divided by 1 plus 100. Wherever I have a x, I'm substituting it with the value of 1. So I have 1 square is 1, 1 plus 1, 2. So 2 divided by 101. Okay. Moving on to the next subsection. I'm simply going to substitute the values to x. So x would have value in the 2. So I have 2 cube minus 4 times 2 square, sorry, square plus 4 times 2 divided by 2 square minus 4. So I have some term in the numerator which is 8 minus 2 2s are 4, 4 4s are 16 plus 8 divided by 4 minus 4. So I know that the 8 plus 8 is 16, 16 minus 16 is 0. So I have 0 by 0 but I should not have a 0 in the denominator. Numerator is 0 in the parvala. Denominator la I should never have a 0. So I am getting a term which is 0 by 0 which is not defined. Okay. So what do I do in such cases? In the chapter we are going to use splitting the middle term. Okay. You will use for more. So what do I The numerator I am going to try to split. So what will I get if I split the numerator? I am omitting the limit for some time. I am only going to solve the particular function. So my f of x is this term. So I am going to take the x outside. So I have x times x square minus 4x plus 4 divided by denominator. I have a square minus b square. So it can be written as a plus b into a minus b. So I have x plus 2 into x minus 2. b square in 2 square 4 is equal x plus 2 into x minus 2. If how can I write this x square minus 4x plus 4? Splitting the middle term panna and go x square minus 4x plus 4. So I want my product to be 4 and I want my sum to be minus 4. So I know 2, 2s are 4, minus, minus. So I'll have x square minus 2x minus 2x plus 4. So x a common at the x minus 2, x minus 2, then taking minus 2 outside equals 0. So this becomes x minus 2 into x minus 2 equals 0. So now what does my f of x become? It becomes X, x into x minus 2 into x minus 2 divided by x plus 2 into x minus 2. If a limit substitute panla, I have limit x tends to 0. x times x minus 2 times x minus 2 divided by x plus 2 into x minus 2. So I can cancel the x minus 2 and the x minus 2. So you see what was causing the 0 by 0? In the earth 2 put a 0, in the earth 2 put a 0. So this term was causing my 0 by 0. So now that I have cancelled, I will not be getting 0 by 0 anymore. Okay. So if a value substitute panna, what will I have? 2 times 2 minus 2 divided by 2 plus 2. So what do I have? 2 times 0 divided by 4. So my denominator is no more a 0. Numerator 0 on the parvala. So I have 0 by 4 which is equal to 0. 0 by 0 though not defined. The denominator cannot be a 0. Okay. Maybe in the higher classes you learn that 1 by 0 or any number. Any a divided by 0 is infinity. But limits in Pakamodu we are not dealing with that. So whenever you get a 0 by 0 it is not defined. And you have to do something. Splitting the middle term or taking something common. Cancelling. So you have to basically cancel the term that is causing a 0. Okay. So this is how you solve. Moving on to subsection 3, I have this to be my f of x and the limit tends to 2. Okay, so when I directly substitute the values, what am I getting? I have 2 square minus 4 divided by 2 cube minus 4x square which is 4 times 2 square. So 4 times 2 square plus 4 into 2. So what do I have? No matter what my numerator is, my numerator can be 0 or it cannot be 0. It's okay. But denominator should never be 0. So whatever the numerator is, it doesn't really matter. But here it's 0. What else do I have? 2 cube is 8 minus 2 square is 4, 4 fours are 16 plus 4 twos are 8. So I have 8 plus 8, 16, 16 minus 16, 0 by 0. So this is not defined. So what is my next step? I'm going to split the middle term or cancel some terms. So I have limit x tends to 2 of x square minus 4 every other law, x plus 2 into x minus 2 like how we did in the previous subsection divided by x cube minus 4x square plus 4x. So, in the end of x common I have x square minus 4x plus 4. So, similarly, it's very similar to the previous question. So, I have x minus 2 into x minus 2 for this. Okay. So, this becomes limit x tends to 2 of x plus 2 into x minus 2 divided by x times x minus 2 
into x minus 2. So the x minus 2 and the x minus 2 will get cancelled. What else do I have? When I substitute the values, 2 plus 2 divided by 2 times 2 minus 2. So I am getting 4 divided by 0. My denominator is still a 0. You cannot. Which means this is still not defined. Okay. So this particular limit is not defined at all. You will simply write it down saying it is not defined. Okay. Moving on to the next subsection. When I substitute the values, I have 2 cube minus 2 times 2 square divided by 2 square minus 5 times 2 plus 6. Numerator n over the denominator n. 2 square is 4 minus 10 plus 6. 6 plus 4, 10. 10 minus 10 is 0. So my denominator is a 0, which means it is not defined. Okay. Now what is my numerator? 8 cube. Sorry, 2 cube is 8, 2 cube is 8. So I have 8 minus 8, which is also 0. So basically it is 0 by 0, which is not defined. So I have to cancel a few terms. So when I take limit, x tends to 2. I'll take x square outside. So I have x minus 2 divided by x square minus 5x plus 6. How can I write it? Okay. So I want my product to be 6. So what can I do? I want the sum to be minus 5. So 2, 3s are 6. So it will be minus 2 and minus 3. So I can do it as x square minus 2x minus 3x plus 6. So what does this become? x times x minus 2, x minus 2. I'll take minus 3 outside. So I'll have x minus 2 times x minus 3. So this becomes my denominator. So when I substitute the values here, what do I have? x minus 2 into x minus 3. So x minus 2 and the x minus 2 gets cancelled. This was the term that was causing the 0 by 0. So if I now go value substitute for now, 2 square divided by 2 minus 3, which is 4 divided by minus 1, which is minus 4. So this is the limit. Okay. Here the limit exists. Here the limit does not exist because the denominator is still a 0 even after cancelling. Okay. Well, this is not defined. Okay. Moving on to the fifth subsection. One substitute panayana go on. The first term becomes 1 minus 2 divided by 1 square minus 1. So this term becomes 1 by 0. Minus in the term I go on. I have x everywhere. So I'll have 1 divided by 0. So basically some number in the numerator minus 1 minus 1 divided by 0 which becomes minus 2 by 0. This is not defined. So we are going to split the terms and cancel them. So first two term in go. I will take this as f of x and I will take this as g of x. Okay. So my f of x becomes x minus 2 divided by x common and I will have x minus 1. How does my g of x change? It is 1 divided by x common and I have x square minus 3x plus I want the product to be 2 and I want the sum to be minus 3. So I have minus 2 minus 1. So this can also be written as I will simply take this particular term. So I have x square minus 3x plus 2 which can also be written as x square minus 2x minus x plus 2. So I have x times x minus 2 x minus 2 minus 1. So I have x minus 2 times x minus 1. So this is my denominator with an x. Don't forget the x. If I now go limit x tends to 1 of f of x which is x minus 2 divided by x times x minus 1 minus this becomes 1 divided by x times x minus 2 times x minus 1. Okay. Now I am going to take the LCM because if you value substitute I will get a 0. So I am going to take the LCM. So what happens? Limit x tends to 1. Or what is my LCM? x times x minus 2 times x minus 1. What term is missing here? x minus 2. So I have to multiply this by x minus 2. So I have x minus 2 the whole square minus 1. I have all the terms here divided by x into x minus 1 into x minus 2. So a minus b whole square in a limit x tends to 1 of a square plus b square minus 2ab which is 2 times 2 into x. So minus 4x minus 1 divided by x times x minus 1 times x minus 2. So what do I have? Numerator la limit x tends to 1 of x square minus 4x plus 3 divided by x times x minus 1 times x minus 2. You see that I have a new quadratic equation in the numerator now. Correct? Huh? So this if we split panla, I want the product to be 3. And I want the sum to be minus 4. So I can write it as minus 3 minus 1. Correct? So minus 3 minus 1. What does my numerator become? x square 
minus 3x minus x plus 3 where I can take the x common. So x into x minus 3. Here x minus 3 now I will have minus 1. So this becomes x minus 1 times x minus 3. So what does my numerator become? Limit x tends to 1 of this becomes x minus 1 times x minus 3 divided by x into x minus 1 times x minus 2. So you see which term was causing the 0? x minus 1 and x minus 1 gets cancelled. So when I substitute the value what will I have? 1 minus 3 divided by 1 times 1 minus 2. 1 minus 3 is minus 2. Minus 2 divided by minus 1 which is 2. Okay. So my final answer is 2.